Yeah, that's good. Alright. What's up, guys? It's Mark from Steel Force Training, joined by Ryan Prashad. How's it going? How you doing, man? Not bad. Good, good. So tell us about yourself. So, my name is Ryan. Uh, I just graduated U of T. And I'm getting back into fitness a lot more now because I'm going to be joining up in the Air Force as a pilot. Really? How's that? Uh, it's great. Yeah. Just got merit listed, and it's just a matter of time now. Right. So what kind of fitness do you need to be in the military? Ah, uh, you need a lot of endurance, you need a lot of power, and you need a lot of sprint, sprint strength. Okay. The type of strength where you can execute a movement quickly. Okay, so very explosive. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I used to be in the infantry. Okay. Uh, back then, uh, it, that taught me a lot about fitness, that taught me a lot about myself. Yeah. And I find that it's that kind of experience that it'll change the way you look at fitness for the rest of your life. Yeah. And, <laughs> Happy about it. <laughs> so, what's been your most memorable experience in the Air Force? In well, I haven't gotten into the Air Force oh, yet, but in, back in the infantry, yeah. uh, basic for sure. Yeah. Basic is when they try and break you. Okay. And uh, sad to say, they did break me one time. Yeah. What happened? Only one time, never again. <laughs> oh, well, it do? was uh, it was a very very long forced rucksack march. Okay. And it just kept going and going. And they for gave those us. They don't know what a. Uh... A rucksack march is yeah. where you pile on all of your gear, it could be anything up to 80 pounds, okay. take your rifle, your attack vest, everything, and you just go. And they give you a destination, <laughs> and you walk there. And when I say walk, I mean you're walking fast. Yeah. Except this march, they gave us a destination that was about 6-7 kilometers away. Then when we got there, we said, oh, I guess the bus isn't here, we're going back. <laughs> <laughs> they knew that though. And that mental game is what'll get you. <laughs> right. So how long did that walk take? Oh, that one took us maybe about... An hour and a half to two hours. Wow. It was a long one. Okay. And I remember back in the day, you used to do a little bit of martial arts as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, martial arts is big in my training. Yeah. Um, I have a black belt in karate. Okay. I got that before I came to university, and since then, I, I stopped doing karate, but I've been doing a lot of Muay Thai, Jiu Jitsu. Okay. All the, all all the popular stuff right now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what are three tips you'd give to someone who's just starting out in the fitness industry, who's trying to get themselves healthy? Stick with it. You don't get results until you've been in, been through a little bit of pain. Yeah. Um, tip number two. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that easy. <laughs> it's not that easy. Right. Stick with it for sure. But tip number two, I'd say work on the things that you are weak at. Right. Because a lot of people, they'll go on the internet and they'll find someone else's plan. Mm -hmm. And they'll just try and copy that plan exercise for exercise. And right. it won't work for them because their body is not the same as that person who's been working out for maybe 10 years. Yeah. Especially if you're just getting into the industry. So find something specific for your needs. Exactly. Find something specific for your needs. Right. Or get a trainer. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> um, number three. Make sure you're balanced. Don't just yeah. work on one area. Don't just work um, strength training all the time and leave out your cardio because cardio training has a lot of benefits to your body too. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. So be varied. I like that. Any last words? Uh, no, let's get this started. No? <laughs> Thanks a lot for your time. It's Ryan Prashad, Mark from Steel Force Training. Thanks for watching.